A U.S. rocket has exploded seconds after liftoff. NASA officials say it was carrying an unmanned freighter bound for the International Space Station, and they say no one was injured. The rocket Antares was developed by an American company called Orbital Sciences. It was launched from a complex in the state of Virginia. But moments after takeoff, the rocket suddenly fell and then blew up in flames. It was carrying the Cygnus cargo ship loaded with about two tons of food and experiments for the astronauts living aboard the ISS. Officials say so far they haven't determined the cause of the explosion. Orbital Sciences is one of two companies hired by NASA to fly cargo to the ISS after the space shuttles were retired in 2011. Uh, our team worked very hard to prepare it. We conducted a lot of testing and analysis to get ready for this mission. Um, however, something went wrong and we will find out what that is. We will determine the root cause and we will uh, correct that and uh, we will come back and fly here at Wallops again. Company officials say several experiments were destroyed, including a special camera developed by Japan's Chiba Institute of Technology. Senior researcher Tomoko Arai says the camera was supposed to be placed on the ISS to observe shooting stars. She witnessed the explosion about three kilometers from the launch site. I thought it was odd that the rocket wasn't really rising, and then there was an explosion. I immediately ran out of the stands. We worked hard to develop the camera for the liftoff, so this is very disappointing. Arai says she and her colleagues have another camera as a backup. She says they will be ready for the next launch.